In this video, we want to talk about vector geometry. Under the vector geometry, we'll be talking about the scalar and the vector quantity. A scalar quantity is a quantity that has magnitude but no direction. And a vector quantity are the type of quantity that has both magnitude and direction. Let's talk about the some of the examples of both vector and scalar. Look at this statement, number one. The outside, the outside temperature, the outside temperature is 15 degrees Celsius. As we all know that temperature does not have any direction, but the 15 degrees Celsius here is talking about the magnitude. Recall that a temperature has no direction. Since temperature does not have any direction, it implies that this is a scalar quantity. Number two, a truck, a truck is traveling at 60 km per hour. Let's look at this. To categorize this under scalar or vector, if you check this very well, you will see that the 60 km per hour here is talking about the magnitude. But the only told us that a truck is traveling at 60 km per hour. We don't know the direction. So it implies that this is also a what? A scalar quantity. Number three. The water. The water is flowing. The water is flowing due north. Due north at five kilometer per hour. Now, if you check this very well, you will see that this five kilometer per hour here is talking about the magnitude. And the due not here is talking about the direction, which implies that this has both magnitude and direction. So we can say that this is a vector quantity. All right, let's do um, one more. Number four. A bulldozer, a bulldozer, a bulldozer moves, a bulldozer moves the rock, the rock eastward, eastward 15 meter. Now, looking at this, you will see that we have a magnitude that is a value of 15 meter and the direction is eastward. It implies that this is a vector quantity. This is how to know the type of quantity you have. In vector quantity, you must have the direction and the magnitude and a scalar quantity must have only magnitude but no direction let's move to representation representation of vectors 
representation of vectors. 